So mm. chocolate milkshakes. Chocolate milkshakes. Yeah. We had a bit of an incident in Manila where I went to Mackey's, I think twice looking for a chocky milkshake. I remember. Didn't get a chocky milkshake. Oh, devastated. Went to France last year. Went to Mackey's and my wife ordered me a Coke. I mean, you got me a Coke. What's the matter with you? <laughs> so I had a Coke and then uh, we went to Mackey's again at a different time and I said, right, this time, I want a fucking chocolate milkshake. All right. So I sent that bitch in there. I'm joking. I love my wife. So I sent her back. I sent her in for a chocolate milkshake. She came back out with a Coke she because they ran out of chocolate milkshake. In fact, I didn't actually serve chocolate milkshake. They only did it in like a dessert, as like a dessert option, like a chocolate ice cream type thing. In like I remember little... you saying this in the Philippines as well. Exactly this. Where do you get chocolate milkshakes from? The UK do it. I'm guessing yeah. you do it in Australia. Pretty sure we do. Yeah, what pretty do we, sure we do yeah, in we America do. as well. Even if we don't so have why? a... Ch- even if there's no chocolate milkshake, we'll have a like a, a frappe. Do you have those? Yeah. Yeah. That's as good as a chocolate it's milkshake. It's like in Europe, they just go, they go, oh, well, well, we don't do chocolate milkshake. So I end up with just having to have Coke. <laughs> Again. Oh, I was, I cannot tell you how good I was. That's a good When video. I got home, I did order a Mackey's. We had a takeaway because we're lazy bastards are. And it, it's always touch and go because our Mackey's is probably like about nearly 10 minutes away to drive and uh, even though it comes through Uber it always gets here it's always on the cold side it's never that great and we always feel really shit after eating it but we still do order because yes, we do. hope that one day it might change and uh, it came out chocolate milkshake and then, oh my god I oh it was so good I loved it it's so <laughs> thick and chocolate and creamy it's just like a little bit of like an orgasm in the pot it's just, it's just great <laughs> oh you're giving me flashbacks of the the drink how you brought it up in the... Uh, was, it, was it a tank, an orange tango? No, oh, oh, oh. Yeah, it the was drink. The, it was the frozen orange one, wasn't it? No, 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 not, not that time when we did the videos with the whole being a reactor and you were talking about your little drink looking like certain white stuff. Oh, spunk yeah. in a cup or something. Yeah. Oh, I can't remember. I can't remember what it was. <laughs> little, little, little stream is spinning around. Yeah, I can't remember the context of that now. I'm sure there's a lot of other things that we were meant to talk about. It's just kind of slipped my mind. So maybe we could talk about Jones. Do you miss her, Dan? Do I miss Jonah? I do a little bit, actually. I know you do. I know you do. I do miss Jonah. As I'm speaking, she's actually having a concert now on YouTube, which just shows the dedication to our channel that, you know, we're committing to creating content. Because I know it'll be available to view at a later date, so I'm not, like, I'm not missing out as such. But you still feel like you are slightly, though. Well, yeah, I'm not, I'm not watching it as it happens. <laughs> um, I'm going to be a bit delayed, that's all. But I, I, am, I, I do miss her a little bit, and uh, you know, I'm, I'm still trying to find a way to kind of meet her again. Because so, I, said, I said to a, a roadie, I was like, you know what, next time I come over... I need to treat you guys to something because, you know, you had the day plan. I mean, I'm, I know she was doing stuff anyway, but it was like, you know, dinner was on the her. We went to the studio and did that duet, which I thought was just exceptional. So I need to, like, return the favour. That's also a good excuse to see her too. There's a little shout. Did you end up sending your present to Jonah, Dan? Yeah, I, I, yeah, I bought her a lovely gift. Oh, it was beautiful. Lovely little, little quaint, yes. quaint necklace. Oh, with a J written on it it's a beautiful little thing I took it with us to Rome to give it to her well we all know how that turned out so for I, the best part of last year I held on to that present I too had a present I held on to it for about I held on to it for about two months only two months wow two months. you lost a lot of love very quickly no it's not even that because I knew that if I wasn't going to see it there probably never going to see you anywhere. Is that a fair assumption to make, Dan? I don't know. I mean, you. there might have been have a I chance. Seen her, have coming. I seen you since? Fucking COVID happened since, <laughs> mate. The whole world's been locked down. No one's going to see any bugger. I know, but I'm just saying. <laughs> oh, that was a good call on my behalf. And I actually thought about it. I'm like, maybe that wasn't meant to be for her, what I got. So Look, who did I can, end up, you, you, who did oh, I end up giving you, it to? I honestly can't remember. So if I went to Sydney roughly two months later. Oh, wasn't it Kirsten? I ended up giving it to Kirsten. 
Because I didn't want to have that memory of seeing whatever I got for Jonah and just constantly staring at it because I'll still be fucking staring at it now. So it had to go. Had to give it to someone. Well, it went to a nice home. Yeah, I think it was meant to go to her too. Yeah. I'm still a bit annoyed with my gift because I, I, I still really like the gift and I really wanted to give it to Jonah. So it's yeah. Kind of a little, I was kind of the same because like, I feel like Jonah would have loved it as well. I think she would have yeah. worn, worn what I had got at least a couple yeah. of times. I still haven't seen Jonah wear the necklace, but that's not to say she's never worn it. It's just she doesn't post that often on social, so who who knows when she has worn it. True. And to be fair, she's, she worn, has, she's worn previous gifts. She has, and I'm I'm pretty sad, but I also like to keep a record of what she's worn <laughs> of mine. <laughs> I should probably rephrase that. When I see an artist wear something that I've bought, I take a screenshot because it, right, it's yeah. just nice to keep a record, it's isn't right. it? Yeah. And uh, let's see what I have in my beautiful little collection. I used to be the same. I used to keep, you know, little little photos here and there. But those have been deleted since. So here's a necklace that I bought Jonah from season two. That's a great photo too. Beautiful. Uh, another, another shot. You know what, now that you brought this up, now that you brought this up, I've bought gifts for several people, right? I've never seen them wear it. People that I'm actually close to. You kind of got me fucked up with that now, Dan, now that you've brought this up. I'm wondering if they've even worn it themselves. You know what? I'm not buying any more gifts, Dan. (laughs) Earrings and necklace. I like that photo. I pretend I'm in front of her when she's doing that. She's eating or Uh, she's posing. I think so. I think she's eating fries or something what I did like about the picture is because it was done as sort of part of a promotional video for I think a concert in Canada with Darren Espanto and uh, oh, yeah. Lana yeah. Lani Lani as well yeah so they did like promotional stuff and she wore it for the promo as well so I was oh, quite yeah, happy yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of hard to tell there you go yeah. so I was very pleased about that um, she did send me a, a message on Messenger to thank me for the necklace even though she hasn't worn it yet I did get a message from her, so I'll, I'll, I'll play that as well, because, you know, why not? It comes in two parts for some reason. This guy is flexing. Hey, Dan and Rachel. This is Jonah. Uh, just want to say thank you so much for the gifts that you sent all the way from UK. Cost a fortune, and, by the way. Um, it's just I sad know. that we didn't get a chance to see each other while we were in Italy, but um, I'm very thankful for all for all the for all the support that um, that you've given to me, and thank you also for being nice to Ria and Ate Erlin. We hope to see you again soon, and for now, um, you guys take care. Uh, just like. You do know that I'm wearing the necklace you, you oh, guys gave me. Better, then. So I hope to take a picture. And Which I haven't seen yet, so, by yeah, the way. That's it. Uh, you guys take care. See you again soon. Bye. And then she sent this one. That's nice. Kisses to you guys and to your little angel. God bless. Yeah. Mate, I kind of regret not sending my gift now. 